Hey everybody, Jacqueline here. Today's video, I wanted to showcase my little tiny travel kit that I keep in the car. So sometimes I won't bring my actual like plain air pack and I like having a tiny little stash of art supplies that I keep in the car. So whenever Ryan and I are like driving along, sometimes I'll have them pull over when there's pretty views behind and I don't have all my art stuff. So this is a perfect little thing to keep in the car. So I wanna go through it and showcase it with you. And if you like this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and a subscribe if you'd like to so more people can see this and you can see more videos that I do while out and about. So this is my little kit. It's made by Topo Designs. I love everything that they make. They have beautiful colors. So I will link this in the, in the description box below if you also want to get it. So let's dive in. So I have a couple different types of paper in here. I have this travel zine that I made out of just regular drawing paper. I made the front look cute because I like to do that. Um, I also drew in little panels so I can just put tiny little sketches in there. It's a nice, tiny, lightweight way of being able to draw while you're on the go in the car. I also like to journal, so I have my extra field notes journal in here. It's just, it's blank right now because I got a three pack, so this is just one of them. So I keep that with it. And with the journal, I use my Pentel Calm 07 nib. Um, just regular ballpoint pen. It's really smooth writing and I like to use it when I'm journaling. And to sketch, I have this extra black wing um, pencil and I like it because while this is more new, it fits perfectly in here lengthwise. And also to draw, I have my Pigma Micron in a 005 nib. It's super tiny because I really like to do little tiny details, but you can use whatever pen you have. Another paper I have is this Stonehenge Aqua Cold Press paper by Legion We Are Paper. Um, this is just the cold press. I also have hot press, but I've finished it. So this is really perfect to have when I'm out and about painting. And then in every kit that I have, I have these little containers holding my kneaded eraser. So I just keep a lot of these handy in like every kit that I make. And then by Art Toolkit, I have tucked in this little rubber band, my actual mini Demi palette with all, not all of my watercolor paints, but a lot of my watercolor paints in these little itty bitty tins. So this is really good. I can, with this paper, be able to just like hold it and paint. So it's really, really helpful to have something tiny that I can keep. And a new to me is this Z Fold one. I have not used it yet. It's brand new to me. So I'm pretty excited to paint some fun scene scenes on this little notebook. And then for water, um, I got one of those Swedish towels and I just cut it in half. So I keep one in my art um, kit in the car and I keep one in another kit. So I really like this for dabbing water. And I keep extra binder clips so I can clip my palette onto the paper. So that's really helpful. And then just some of my business cards. I have a whole bunch of these. So I just tuck them everywhere that I can. And usually I have a water brush pen. But clearly I have moved it away from here. So I need to get another one so it could just stay in here. But I also have that. So I'm going to set this up so you can kind of see how my little scene is. So I've sketched out my little scene that I'm painting in front of me and Ryan ran back to the car and he actually found my watercolor brush. It had, it had fallen out. So this is kind of how I set it up. I just clip on the sides and it's just super tiny. I can keep this in my lap and it looks like it's about to rain. It's starting to rain. So it's like easy to just pack up and take uh, with us in the car when we need to run back to the car. So this is how tiny and easy it is to set up. And I love having a water brush to be in the 
car kit because it just makes it easier so you don't have to deal with a bottled water or a cup of water. This makes it really easy. And yes, here comes the rain. I feel it. So I might hop in the car to finish this. <laughs> Let's go. So I'm back in the car because it started raining, but we parked right here where I can still see the scene. So I'm gonna continue painting here in the nice coziness of the car. <laughs> Sorry that that was kind of a shorter video because of the rain, um, but you never know when inspiration is going to strike. Ryan and I were driving down this road and we saw this beautiful view and so I had him pull over and I thought it'd be perfect to show you guys what I keep in my little kit that I keep in the car. So let me know down below in the comments what else you might keep in here. I'd love to hear what you guys have uh, in your kits and if this also inspired you to keep one in the car because again, you never know when inspiration is going to strike. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Cheers.